Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, I'm gonna model Halloween scene in Blender and also I'll use Cycles Render Engine. Before I start the video, if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, you can support me by hit the subscribe button and don't forget to like the video. You can also follow my works from other social media platforms, links in the description. If you're interested in 3D modeling and game development, you can join our Discord channel and chatting about these topics. And also you can play games with together on the game channel. So let's move on to the video. First we clean the scene and add a sphere for pumpkin. In the sculpt mode I remesh the object with shift R and apply it by pressing ctrl R. I turn the mesh filter type in smooth, then press and drag it. With the grab brush I deform the form. Using draw and crease brush I draw straight lines. For creating a procedural material in the shader tab, I'm adding a noise texture and color ramp for color changing. Copying the noise texture and connect it with the bump node to the normal. Adding one more noise texture for small details and connecting them with mix RGB node. For the cavity, I connect pointless geometry node to color ramp and also connect them with mix RGB node. For the stem, I edit the sphere and adding loop cuts. Also using same material by copying and changing some colors and delete the geo node. Mm -hmm. 
As you can see, we have so much polygon. For decreasing it, I am adding a remesh modifier. In the smooth category, changing it to something like 6 looks nice for now. For giving it a thickness, I am adding a solidify modifier. I bevel the edges of the cube. And by pressing Ctrl Shift B, I am adding a boolean modifier for the door. Also doing same thing for the windows. With editing a basic sphere, I create the windows and give it a basic glass material, with increasing the transmission. Then I place them into our pumpkin. Also create a door with the same way. For the plane, I give 30 subdivide and deform the surface with proportional editing objects by selecting and moving some faces. I copy the same material and change some inputs. For the grass, I'm adding PNG plant texture. You can find it in the textures.com and I'll drop the link in the description. In the particle system tab, we choose the hair and turn on the advanced mode. In the render part, we choose object and select our plant objects. We give it a random scale, amount and rotation. For creating the trees, I merge the vertices of a cube and extrude them. I am adding a skin modifier and by pressing Ctrl A, I scale the vertices. Then extrude them for the roots. I am also copying the same material and scale it on the Z axis a little bit. then place them into our scene.
for the headstone, I beveled edges of a cube and sculpted it with the same techniques. Using Max Brush, I am writing a text and then with Mesh Filter, I extrude it. For the material, I just add a Geo and Color Ramp node for easier reading. Then put them into our scene. I also use same techniques for the stair stone, but just adding some holes with blob brush. Then adding a point light into our house and increase the windows emission for lighting. And this is the final result after some lighting adjustments. I added basic circle for the moon and gave it an emission material. If you like this content, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to my channel. And you can write your thoughts about this video in below to the comments. Also you can reach my other social media accounts from the description part. See you guys in the next video, happy halloween.